How you doing? This is Ardell Couch here at the San Antonio Board of Realtors. I'm the super coordinator. I want to show you today how to hook your computer up to the USB port of a PC using Microsoft Windows as your operating system. As you know, the USB cradle will not work on a Mac. So this is strictly for using it on the PC using Microsoft Windows as your operating system. The first thing you want to do, you want to go to Sabor.com. That's www.sabor.com. Once you get to sabor.com, you'll see our splash page. And you'll see a square, a green square that says member portal. You're gonna click on that square. And once you do that, it's gonna take you to the screen that you normally see. You'll see a red box in the left-hand corner that says property search. Below that box, you'll see a box that says member services. You're gonna click in the box that says member services. Once you click in that box that says member services, you're going to see a gray toolbar go across the top of your go across the screen. You're going to follow that gray toolbar across until you see MLS. Highlight MLS and you'll see a drop down box and in that drop down box you'll see a link that says MLS Super Keys. Once you see that box you're going to clip on you're going to click on MLS Super Keys. You'll get to the page that shows you that you're in the MLS Super Keys tab. You're going to go down to the fifth bullet and it'll say USB Cradle Download. Click here. You're going to click on that link. Once you click on that link, it's going to say, do you want to run it or do you want to save it? You actually want to click Save. Once you, do, once you do that, it's going to go to another screen and you're going to see a box that says Save As, Save In. In the little skinny window that says Save In, you want to make sure that it reads Desktop. Now the most common position that's, that, that that setting is in is you'll see My Docs and you'll see a whole bunch of your folders of your documents. What you want to do is on the left hand side right above that, there's a button that says Desktop. Once you click Desktop, then all the current icons that's on your desktop will show up in this box. And then all you have to do is click Save. Once you click Save, then you'll see a folder start to download uh, this file onto your desktop. Once the download is complete, you'll see an icon out there on your desktop. You're going to double click the icon and then it'll start executing the installation process. Then it will prompt you on the screen when to hook up your cradle. You don't want to have your cradle connected while you're doing your download and all that. But once it prompts you, you're going to take your USB cable and plug it into the USB port of your computer. Once you do that, it's going to do a diagnostics test to see if your computer recognizes it. If you get a message that says computer cannot detect cradle, you want to be sure that you call the tech support number on the back of your key. If you look at the back of your super key, you'll see tech support and you'll see a 1877 number. Go ahead and call that number. You'll get in touch with an actual person that will walk you through and show you how to lower your firewall. Because when you see that prompt that the computer cannot detect the cradle, it's usually because your firewall is set too high. If you're comfortable, you can lower it yourself, but I always suggest to call the tech support number on the back of your key. And that's how we connect the USB cradle to your PC on a Microsoft operating system. Thank you.